lay out all your tools and ensure you have all the necessary parts. Slide the ladder hook onto the rear crossbar first and position it 12 inches from the end. Tighten the bolts to secure it in place. Repeat the same steps for the front crossbar. The tops of the ladder hooks should be pointing at each other. Next, attach all four feet to the crossbars. To do so, slide two channel nuts into either side of the crossbar and attach the foot using a flat washer, lock washer, and hex bolt. Before tightening, be sure the length to the end of the crossbar is correct for your vehicle. The lengths are noted in the install guide and repeat these steps for all four feet. Next, attach the rung stopper to the front crossbar. Place the carriage bolts into the insert plates and slide them onto the crossbar. Then attach the rung stopper with your flat washer, lock washer, and hex nut. It should be on the inside of the crossbar. The next step is to attach the ski mount to the front of the crossbar. With your impact wrench, fasten the ski mounts with hex bolts. Repeat this step for both crossbars. Next, Slide the plastic ladder holders onto the end of both crossbars. Take the long straight end of the ski and slide four carriage bolts down to the bottom. After that, connect that part of the ski to the other half. Bolt them together using a hex bolt and two flat washers on one side and a flat washer and lock nut on the other. Set your crossbars apart to the correct distance according to the install guide. There are 65 inch and 77 inch versions. Then lay the ski across them. Be sure the curved end of the ski goes on the front crossbar. Attach the ski to the ski mount using a carriage bolt, flat washer, lock washer, and hex nut. Repeat this step so that the ski is bolted to both crossbars. The final step is to attach the throttle latch to the ski. Make sure it is about 10 inches away from the center of the two skis and bolt it in using a carriage bolt, flat washer, lock washer, and hex nut. If you're driving without a ladder, be sure to lock the throttle latch in place with the hasp so that it doesn't bump against the side of your van. To fit the ladder you plan to carry, place the ladder on the rack. Be sure to pull the ladder forward so that the rung hits the ladder stop. Then move the ladder hooks to press securely against the ladder and bolt them tightly in place. Move the throttle latch along the ski until the hook is directly behind a rung when it is latched. Tighten in place. This prevents the ladder from sliding backwards during acceleration.
If you have a ladder that is too large or too thin to fit the preset hook, you can easily adjust the setting on the throttle latch. Remove the bolts on the latch and adjust the height to meet your needs. Then reattach the bolt securely. The over center latch should close firmly and even bend the ski a little when installed properly. We hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching.